Jameson, just how in sync did you feel early on in this one? Yeah, yeah, I felt good. I felt like I had every single pitch working. Uh, we were using all four really well to every different part of the plate. Um, you know, I felt good. I felt good the whole time. Um, me and Higgy were rolling pretty well, and the offense spotted us a lead, so it allowed us to be pretty aggressive there for a few innings and keep the pitch count in check. When you do get a lead like that, just is it how much of a luxury is it to be able to be aggressive and, and not to have to be so fine and worry about every single pitch? Yeah, yeah. I mean, it allows you to have an inning like the sixth where the mistakes can err on the side of aggression and attacking guys as opposed to, like, falling behind guys and walking guys and stuff like that. So, um, you know, that sixth inning kind of got off the rails a little bit. But at the same time, when you have a lead like that, I mean, I'll take living on the aggressive side and making them beat us by putting the ball in play over, you know, the alternative any day. You seem just about as frustrated as we've ever seen you when you came out in that sixth inning and, and mm. sat in the dugout. What was it about the way things transpired that frustrated you so much? Yeah, uh, it was probably just because I felt so good tonight and I thought the first five and a third innings went so well. Um, you know, I thought tonight was a night where I probably could have pitched into the eighth. You know, I felt that, that kind of way tonight. So to have it end at five and a third was pretty frustrating. Um, you know, but after having some time to reflect and stuff, I went back and watched the pitches, and, you know, there's not really much I would change, especially with a six-run lead, so it is what it is. Go next to Greg Joyce. James, they're just checking when you caught that pop-up in the six, were you fine physically from that, or did that take any kind of a toll? Yeah, no, I was I was fine. Um, it got a little awkward just because I saw it at the corner of my eye. Tyler Wade sprinting at me, and we all know he can run extremely fast, so I, I didn't really feel like having him kind of take my legs out. So I dove a little bit, uh, but, yeah, I mean, that was a pretty easy play and something I expect to make every time. Anyone else for Jameson? Brian Clark, go ahead. <clears throat> Yeah, Jamison, just what have you noticed over these seven games that the team as a whole is doing really well? There's a lot of things. I feel like every night it kind of changes a little bit. There's nights where the starting pitching has been extremely dominant. There's nights where the bullpen comes in and picks us up. There's nights where the offense just scratches and claws uh, and gets us enough. And then there's nights like tonight where they put, you know, get the starter out of the game early and put up a big crooked number. Um, so I actually, I don't know, I feel like it's been a lot of different things. And I think... I think that's the sign of a good team is when you can win in a bunch of different ways. Like, we don't have to blow you out to win. We can win the close games. We can also slug. We can put up runs. We can have the starting pitching and the bullpen and the defense. Um, so I feel like it's kind of just been a little bit of a mix and match.